start this morning. Everybody else is still asleep and it's raining outside, but I've got a gig to go to. So, time to get ready, put my kilt on, put my uniform on, load up the car, let's roll. Life. Getting a little bit lighter outside, still raining, still cold, but stop by my local gas station, pick me up some of this coffee. Uh, I used to get it when I was in England, um, so it's nice to have a little taste of home. Not sponsored, by the way. Um, but, gotta start the day off with some coffee. <sighs> Driving now to the church, um, so uh, yeah, I'll see y'all in a few minutes. All right, just arrived, and I'm early. There's nobody here, the parking lot is empty, so I'm gonna sit here and chill. So as I mentioned in one of my previous videos, I like to stay sharp, I like to find ways to keep myself, you know, at the peak of my condition. Uh, I'm, you know, I'm not saying I'm the best drummer out there, absolutely not, but, to keep me sharp. Hold on, let's get some light on the subject here. Maybe this will be better. Eh, maybe. So, and, and this is one of the ways I do it. I, I like to attend uh, church kirkins and there's a few churches around my area that hire myself and a bagpiper to play several of their events over the years. Um, and, and today it's... Uh, December 20th and uh, one of the local churches has a uh, Christmas gathering so uh, we, we're gonna be playing the, the bagpipes and, and drums um, <clears throat> or drum because I'm the only one um, I will be playing the snare drum today so don't hold that against me but uh, you know, it's uh, one of the ways I I you know stay sharp during the, the the off season or during down periods um, and yes it's the snare drum so it's not the bass or the tenor but it keeps your hands moving it keeps your mind fresh with the pipe tunes and you know while I'm playing the snare my mind is often playing the bass or the tenor parts as well and, and so that helps me stay in the zone for and you're piping and drumming. And so... Sorry, I'm just watching some people uh, coming out of the church now. Looks like there's a couple of people showing up, which is great. Um, so what's the point in today's video? Alright. You know, recently I've been talking about giving away a bass drum. You've seen it in several of my videos. And so I want to talk a little bit more about that. Um, after the holidays, I will be running a competition to give away a bass drum. I've said that. Um, and so I'm hoping to go to a Highland Games uh, here in the south somewhere. Uh, either Florida, South Carolina, North Carolina, Georgia. Somewhere around there. Um, and give away a bass drum at the Highland Games. So there's going to be some rules to follow for you know to make it fair on everybody um, but one of the things I will be doing is I'll be looking around the games for my merchandise I'll be walking through the games recording uh, me searching for merchandise and it's specific merchandise. You know, I'll be looking for my hats, my sweaters, my t-shirts, my towels, uh, and, and a bag with my logo on. Um, so if you want to win that bass drum, recommend you go in and checking out my Etsy store and, and grabbing yourself a shirt or a sweater or, or, or one of those, those items. Um, but then there's also, you know, a couple other things too that that I'll be I'll be looking for when I find that person. So the next rule is when I've found you, 
you have to be able to prove that you are following my YouTube page and have liked five of my videos. Now that's not much to ask. Um, so you know the way to do that: just pull out your phone, open up YouTube, you know, make sure you sign into your YouTube channel, and go to my channel. And uh, let's we we can see quite quickly that you've subscribed and you've liked five of my videos. Of course, if you like them. Um, and then the the last thing is that you like and follow my RD Pro Sticks Facebook page. Once those th three things are met, you will win the bass drum. But I want to continue to meet y'all, so you know I don't want to find, you know, the per the winner, um, you know, ten minutes into the, the into the day, and and then and that's it. So I also want to give away a pair of RD Pro Stick mallets. Um, I will be giving away a pair of regular base mallets in uh, black or white. Um, and again, the same rules apply. I'll be walking through the games. I'll be looking for that same merchandise. Again, if you like my YouTube page and five of my videos and follow my Facebook page, you'll win the RD Pro Stick mallets. So there's a couple of items to win, a um, couple of chances to win. If I don't find somebody at the first Highland Games, I'll post another Highland Games that I'll be at. I'm hoping to be at two or three this year, COVID allowing. So you know, stay tuned, watch the videos, and you know, I'm I'm hoping that you know, I can give somebody their very own bass drum and RD Pro Stick mallets. It's a great opportunity to bring music to somebody that isn't quite fortunate enough to be able to afford their, their own instrument or mallets. So I, I highly recommend people just taking a, a few minutes to you know, check out the competition, check out my YouTube page, check out my Facebook page, and you, know, you can win yourself a bass drum, win yourself some mallets, or win it for somebody else. Um, there's actually a, a couple of bands out there that I, I've recently learnt about that can't afford their own bass drum. And can't afford their own kilts. Uh, so we'll be running a fundraiser event for that band to be able to get their own bass drum. Now I'm not looking for a ton of money. You know, I'm I'm probably gonna buy the bass drum on eBay, a secondhand one, and I'm gonna do it up. But I need your help. I will be raising funds to purchase that bass drum. To purchase new heads, I will take the time to refurbish the bass drum, to tune it up, and hand deliver it to that band. So stay tuned for another video on that. Um, but that, that's kind of what my vlog today is all about. It's you know giving away bass drums. It's you know giving the opportunity for people to be able to experience music to. You know, have their own instrument, to have their own mallets, and you guys are pivotal in that role. You guys are great supporters, great helpers, and I I know this is probably a little long, drawn-out video, but you know, being able to reach out to y'all through this medium is incredible. You know, being able to help others, especially here at Christmas time. You know, and and kick off this competition is is great, and to start spreading the word on getting help to less fortunate pipe bands, and, and so this this is kind of what I'm going to make my vlogs about uh, in the next few weeks and months is is just helping others, helping other bands, being able to let them experience the music, to have their own instruments, to have their own mallets is is something I'm going to be all about in, in the coming year. Um, so I need your help with that. You guys are incredible supporters 
of that. I know several of you are always open and, and ready for causes like this. And so I appreciate that so much. This guy's awesome. Playing already. Woo! Bagpipers are always tuning, but we are warmed up, ready to go. Awesome. That was awesome. That was another wonderful little church service done. Let me get this hat off. Ooh, yeah, look at that. That's what I like to call it. Glen Gary's Lament right there. Oh, man. Glen Gary hair all over the place. But what a good time. Now, I never claimed to be the best snare drum in the world, so excuse that bit of playing there, but it's always fun. I, I enjoy it. You know, obviously some slightly different tunes than usual, some slightly more Christmassy tunes, some churchy tunes, uh, we all love that. Christian, he's an awesome player, he's been playing with me now for, oh, well over 10 years. So he and I have got some amazing history together. I, I appreciate him and his whole family, they are wonderful people. Um, so that's it, I'm wrapping up the vlog today. Um, if I don't see you all before, Merry Christmas bless everybody thank you all so much for continuing to watch my videos uh, uh, they will improve I, I you know will keep working on them um, but you're all uh, amazing people and I thank you all for your support um, God bless you all thank you very much and I'll see y'all next time